Hello, and welcome back to Fahrenheit. If you forget the near to the end or so, I don't know. But what I am going to do is to follow the story of Lucas Kane to the unknown place. Get ready? What? The Indigo Child? Is that her? I said, oh, so I can find out where she is now. I have that address. I should dress up like that. What? It was that short? Okay, no, I'm fine with it. Let's go with Carla Valentin. Almost the entire country is now without water and electricity services. The army has been mobilized to help provide shelter and basic necessities. Oh, it's Cold freezing. and snow have hampered ground movement, and storms have shut down every airport in the country. Scientists are still unable to fully explain the reason behind the cold wave which has now gripped the entire planet. Temperatures continue to fall everywhere in the world as authorities ponder. Well, our job is done. Now it's up to the army to do what they can to help the population. Carla, you should get some sleep. You haven't closed your eyes in two days. I have to get warm to do that. I'm solid ice from head to toe. Yeah. Hey, look, can I get real with you here for a sec, Carla? I think it's hmm? probably now or never. I get the feeling you're hiding something from me on this cane thing. Am I right? Admit. Yeah, you're right. I found him, but I think he's innocent. I didn't say anything because I didn't want to get you involved, Tyler. You mad at me? Nah, of course not. Plus, with everything that's going on now, I guess it doesn't really matter. Anyway... As long as you do what you think is right, you can't go too wrong. Hmm? <gasps> oh, okay. This doesn't look good. Sam, what are you doing here, babe? There's a train leaving in one hour for Florida. It'll probably be the last one for a long time. Uh, I'll be on it, Tyler. With or without you. If you really love me, quit the police and come with me. When this cold stops, we'll get on with our lives. Our new normal lives. It's time to make a choice, Tyler. Leave, Tyler. Oh, I love you too damn much, Sam. I wouldn't let you go for anything in the world. Oh, Tyler, I was so afraid of losing you. Aww. I think it's a good thing. I'll be with you in a minute. Uh, I don't know if I get to... I think this is... Hey, Tyler, what's new? What's this? Coffee? Yeah, I never seen this. Okay, I think it's really cute. Where I get to choose to leave or stay with or retire her, she said. Why did I knock on the door? Try to see if I can find a card or so. In this ice hole. If I maybe I can enter the office to take a look. No, okay, I guess I have to go back to Connor. I'm so sorry about that. <sighs> okay. Carla, I... As long as you do what you think is right, you can't go too wrong. Good luck in Florida, Tyler. Aww. So, I'm not gonna come have him around anymore? 
55 mind senses. Are you sure you know what you're doing? The Oracle's seen the child, just like I did. He'll be here to find her any minute now. I've got to get to her before he does. Wait for me here. I won't be long. All right. Ah, uh, that snowstorm, though. There's no time to lose. I've got to find that girl before the Oracle does. Okay. At least I know how she looks. At least. A nun? Sir? Sir? You can't go in there! Stop me. Got to do this quickly. The Oracle will be here any second. Nope, that was not there. Okay, I have to be fast. Ah, this camera, I swear to God. Nope, that's not her, it seems. She has to be here somehow. How many doors? Okay, there's not too many doors. I still have enough time, I think. Nope. Oh, a card. Thank you. Uh, what is she? Okay, maybe she's in there? None of these girls seem to be reacting while well I'm here. Uh, camera, really? Uh, where could she be? She has to be here somewhere. That's not her. Uh, she's not in this room, goddammit. Uh, I don't have time, I only have three more rooms to sack. Okay, I'm gonna check this one and then I'll take the other turn because I do not have time for anything. Who's you this? Go in, sir. Who's this? Her name is Jade. Parents unknown. Autistic. She's never spoken. Why does she seem like she's well dressed? Oh, that's her. I've seen you in my dreams. You have to come with me. We have to leave here right now. Yeah. Okay, I have her. Okay, girl. Everything is gonna be fine. So, uh -oh. I see you're still alive. I don't know how you've managed it, but that's of no importance now. Give me the child, and I will grant you a rapid death. If you take her to the ones you serve. They'll use her to make slaves out of the entire human race. That's no concern of yours. You'll be dead before that comes to pass. Give me the child. I don't have time to play with you. And I don't have time to play with you either because I'm gonna go through the exit. Bye bye. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. What? How did you get up there? Okay, girl, listen up. I'm leaving you here. You mustn't move, understand? I'll be back soon to get you. I hope. You hope? What? Ah! Uh. Is this Matrix on the top? Ah! Ah! Ooh! Jesus! I can't do all this! Oh, bitch lapping, aren't we? Ah! Uh. Oh! This is like... This is like woman bitch slapping each other. Jesus! Lucas, you're getting 
really is sassy right now. The best kick I ever. Oh, what is this with this Matrix look? I'm having an itch. Ugh. Ah, Jesus. Oh, you didn't break any of those other guys. I'm proud of you, Lucas. All this paid off. Ow. Ow. You know what? Bring it on. against this guy again okay bitch I must not make too many mistakes because all the life I'm gonna use it what the fuck am I doing wrong? Okay, can I have one break? Okay, I'm gonna change into a different uh, controller because the other one has a cover and I think that got between the R1 and L1, it's messed up so much. Okay, let's do this again. Ah, oh, this is so much easier, bitch! Ooh! How many are, How long must I fight with you? You're fucking how many, how many, how many gonna get cast bullshit? Just stop it already. Where is it? Nope. <laughs> nope. Just, ah, uh, just low. Just low. You suck. It's like not giving shit. No! No 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 uh, this is like two bimbos fighting each other. Eat, 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 eat. Take that bitch! No, 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 no! Ah! Okay, I think it. What is? What am I doing wrong? Come on, you can do it! Look at! Ah, it doesn't count as fail for some reason. Wow! Ooh, that got to hurt. Damn right, that gotta hurt. You fucker. A chapter? I'm gonna save you, kid. Ah, oh, he's controlling the chapter! No! Oh god! Yeah! What the hell are you doing? And now you're Spider-Man? Uh, oh, this is so epic! No!
I lost balance, alright? No! Really? I have to try again? Because I did too much? Are you serious? Okay, I have shoot. No, 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 no. Keep on the blue, keep on the blue, keep on the blue. Keep. What the fuck? What? Excuse That's how my me? story ends. I failed. Just before escaping with the Indigo Child. I could have protected her and saved humankind. But the Oracle was more powerful than I was. I don't know what happened next. To be honest, I'm just as happy not being around to see it. Hey, I am not happy. I press like a crazy guy. What? I have to go through all this again? Oh, you're boring. <sighs> I wonder what's on TV tonight. Ooh, I wonder what I should have for dinner. And something else. Can you please stop it? You're never gonna win as the way, boy. Ah, too late. Bitch. Yep. Don't touch me. I'm gonna make it! And you aren't gonna stop me! Yeah! Where am I? Yeah! I made it! Huh. That was not so easy. I had to try a second time and it seemed you to work. found the child. Agatha. Humanity's fate for the next 10,000 years depends on the fate of that child. A new golden age, peace and security, or the reign of ice, of terror and death. We were right to have chosen you. Wait. You manipulate. You. You've been using me from the start, haven't you? You manipulated me so I'd find the girl for you. Manipulated isn't really the word. Let's say, guided. We intervened to protect you because we knew you could lead us to her. Agatha. You're not really Agatha, are you? No, you're right. Poor Agatha died in her apartment. We've simply borrowed her physical appearance to allow us to communicate with you. You asshole! What happened at the amusement park? I don't remember anything after the roller coaster collapsed. You didn't survive the fall. We what? found your body and we resuscitated you. The truth is that you are dead, Lucas. Resuscitated? You brought me back? We have certain expertise that may surprise you. Bringing you back to life was nothing exceptional for us. It was vital that you bring us the Indigo Child, and you succeeded. Now we can put her in a safe place. You've accomplished your mission well. I refuse. No, I don't trust you. Jade stays with me. You're committing a fatal error, Lucas. What? I'm going to have to eliminate you. Oh, no, you don't. Oh. Forgot one small detail. When we brought you back to life, we added a module within your cortex. It's impossible to kill you, as you are already dead. I can, however, annihilate you. A simple touch from me, and you will be erased forever. There's no use trying to resist. I have control of you now. No, 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 no! You can do it, Lucas! You can do it! I refuse to give up! Yeah! Jesus! Get up, Lucas! Hurry! <gasps> Clara! Quickly! Over here!
Can you really stop that thing? Jesus. Oh, this is too much. Okay, Charles. Okay, is there some card here? No? Even the train station here on the ground is... Wait, am I in the train station? I did go to, to a steamer, but... Oh, this is there. Okay, thank you. Is there something here? Nope. Let's play with Charles. Of course, we're supposed to go here. Supposed to walk, my bad. Oh. What's over here? Oh, and then. But this is the under underground. <gasps> oh, a card! Yay! Uh, I don't think I'm gonna find all the cards. I feel like I missed some. There's not much for me to say about it either. Man. Do you know who that man is? I have no idea. He just told me we had to follow him. Jade? So, she's the one. This is the Indigo child? Her name is Jade. She doesn't speak. I get the feeling that for the moment, she's observing us. So, what do we do now? Looks like we don't have much choice. Let's follow him. Okay. She doesn't seem to have anything emotional or so. <gasps> the brother! You're safe and sound. Oh. Marcus! How did you end up here? They came looking for me. They explained everything, Lucas. I know now that you weren't crazy. I hope that you can forgive me for doubting you. I couldn't possibly have known that you were really... What are you talking about? Our host will explain everything. Hmm. Before that, I want to see... Can I go inside here? Yes, I can. Ooh. Is that a mattress or something? I don't know. It looks like a hobo has been living here. Either way, let's leave out this train. What are these people? Welcome to the camp of the invisibles, Lucas. Come and take a seat by the fire. In a bit. Extra life? Cool! Okay, that's probably a worth something. I don't know, it just feels like it. Is there anything else around here I have to be aware of? Because I want to make sure I have like almost anything here. Okay, now let's go to the group. It's probably something. What am I to sit down? Okay. Who are you? Who are you? Why did you help us? We're the Invisibles. Since the dawn of time, we've been secretly observing the clans. Our mission is to ensure that the Indigo Child doesn't fall into the wrong hands. Oh, you're the guy from the beginning, not the freezing guy. Kirsten, who's Kirsten? You're the ones who sent me that email on Kirsten, aren't you? 
And normally we never intervene directly, oh. but it seemed necessary to help you see that Lucas wasn't really guilty of murder. We thought that you might ultimately help him in his mission. So you were the one who sent the mail about that. How about the Agatha? What's her deal about this? There's another clan besides the Orange Clan, isn't there? The thing that took on Agatha's form wanted the child too. Now, we've only recently become aware of the perfect plan. We know almost nothing about them. We suspect that some AIs acquired a sort of consciousness using the net during the 80s. They want the indigo child in order to become the dominant life form on the planet. First the dinosaurs, then man, now artificial intelligence. Hmm. Indigo child, what about her? What do you know about the indigo child? She's a perfectly pure child whose soul has never been incarnated. Her coming has been awaited since the dawn of time. Prophecy. What is the message of the prophecy? It announces the birth of the indigo child. The child have the answer to all questions and the one who hears her message will have access to infinite power but if the child has not been heard before the final countdown humanity will cease to exist so she is that important orange clan who is really behind the orange clan nobody knows for sure it's said that there are five to control the world. Administration, police, army, finance, the media. They control everything. Over the centuries, the Orange Clan has built an empire that runs the entire world. Hmm. So, what do we do now? We must bring the Indigo Child to a source of the Chroma. That's where she'll deliver her message and complete the prophecy. Where do we find this chroma source? There are only three known to exist on the planet. The closest can be found on an old military base called Wishita. Wait. Wishita? That's where I was born. My yeah. parents were a scientist. They were working for the government. Ah, and that explains many things. In the 50s, an artifact was discovered that was not of human origin. It turned out to be a chroma source. We must bring the indigo child there as quickly as possible, before she wastes away and dies without having delivered her message. Oh. When do we leave? In two hours. The time it'll take to finish preparations on your vehicle and to find you enough gasoline. It seems likely that the orange and purple clans will be waiting for you at Wichita. They will stop at nothing to prevent you from uniting the child with the artifact. We will take care of the child and give her a bit of chroma to help her hang on. There are some mattresses in the wagon back there. I suggest you get some rest before you have to leave. You have a long journey ahead of you. Tomorrow may well be the last day of the human race. Oh, that's horrible. So I guess we're getting really close to the end, huh? I'm dead tired, Carla. I'm gonna take Bogart's advice and get some sleep. I don't think I can sleep right now. I'm gonna wander around a bit and join you later. <laughs> I believe this is the last episode. Since we're getting so far, we're actually heading to the last station. Okay, let's see. Yeah, it's freezing cold. It might be the last day on Earth. Oh, that keeps her happy at least. Okay, Carla. So, we seem to get really far with the indigo child and everything. Let's see. Hmm. Maybe I should try and ask others, like... Marcus' brother or something, because I'm kind of curious. Hmm. Nope. 
questions from you. No questions from the father either. I was told to wonder a little bit, but for what? Ah. How's she doing? She's finally asleep. She doesn't have much strength left. I did what I could, but she needs a chromosome real bad. That's bad. That's really bad. Hmm. Is there anything else I can do here, or oh, what's this? Is it like a radio? An old radio. If I could get it to work, maybe I could get some news from up top. Seems hmm. to be in pretty good shape. Just need some batteries and an antenna. Ah, that that makes more sense. Okay, let's see the flashlight. If it has some battery, because that makes more. Eh, eh, back in the car. Because that makes more. Yes, it makes more sense. Because they use those big batteries. Flashlights. I'm gonna steal the batteries out of one for the radio. Okay. This should work. Hmm. I need some batteries and an antenna to have any chance of this thing working. Antenna? So, I'm supposed to look for antenna. How about this gun? No? No, okay. No, not even this. Maybe I can ask the guy in the wagon what he said. No, not this one. Or unless there is something here? Well, there's a box here, but I don't see anything else. Hmm. It needs an antenna, it says. Can I speak to you? No? She got suck. Hmm. Huh? What? What's this? An iron rod. This'll work as an antenna for the radio. Really? Just like that? Okay. No, I, I'm actually learning stuff here. Okay. Let's see if it works. There we go. It should work now. No music, please. Two-thirds of the country are completely without power this morning. Residents are chopping up wood wherever they can find it in an effort to keep warm. In a few days, the planet will revert to the Stone Age. Only a few cities can still count on... The government has declared a level one state of emergency. The army has been deployed throughout the nation to discourage looting and protect those unable to remain in their homes due to the cold. Several hundred thousand men have been attached to emergency services in order to... All the oceans of the globe are now almost entirely frozen over. Jesus. The Atlantic Ocean is closing up and there are only a few hundred miles in the middle of the Pacific which haven't been covered over by the ice flow. If the temperature continues to fall, it seems likely that... And I'm telling you the truth. This cold wave is a divine punishment for all of humanity's sins. God. Is sick and tired of our faithless uh, evil ways. Shut and he's gonna up. the planet of the unworthy and declare the dawn of a new era, just like he did with Noah's flood. I'm not be afraid, my brothers, because God's will is all powerful. How about to kill yourself? Not fear his wrath, because yeah, just stop that. The apocalypse. The future of the world is going to be decided tomorrow at Wishita. That's horrible. Well, I did get a trophy for it though, so I shouldn't be too concerned. 
Hmm, what was I supposed to do after this? Lucas. I still haven't checked on him. Hey, Lucas. Lucas, I'm here. Oh. Well, they should both catch some grass. Still not asleep? No, I can't seem to relax. It's hard to believe that it's all going to end tomorrow, isn't it? The fields, the forests, the cities, everything will disappear under the ice. And what's going to happen to us? It'll be like we never existed, like, like nothing important ever happened. Are you afraid to die? Not anymore. If we're both going to die tomorrow, I want you to know something. I... I'm sorry that we didn't meet under better circumstances. Maybe if things had turned out differently. No, 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 no. Ah. Frozen. Your lips are like ice. I love you, Lucas. Okay, you confess in you. No! Really? No boobs. Okay, no boobs. No. I have to censor those. Even though it's pixel, but yeah, I have to censor those. Why in this moment? Why? I can understand, this is like the final moment of life. There's no way to be sure that you're gonna survive. Huh? Okay. That's small Lucas again. From what the hair is, it sounds more like something me when I don't have hearing aid on. All I hear is this. So now you know. Am I supposed to? Let's see. Is there anything else? Oh. There's a difference, Sam. I was pregnant with Lucas when I went for the first time. Lucas was radiated by the artifact when he was still in the womb. He knew the hangar was going to burn, John. I'm sure of it. But he wasn't the one who started the fire. Look, Mary, that's just not possible, and you know it. Nobody can see things before they happen. That oh. artifact emitted a kind of radiation that we still don't understand. Maybe it changed something in Lucas. That's nonsense. We analyzed everybody who ever came near that thing, and they all checked out fine. Don't you see? If it was the artifact, then we'd all be radiated, and we'd all There's have powers. There's a difference, powers. John. I was pregnant with Lucas when I went for the first time. Lucas <laughs> was radiated by the artifact when he was still in the womb. This is just ridiculous, oh. Mary. I've heard enough. I'm going to take a walk while you calm down. Lucas? What are you doing there? Lucas? Lucas? Oh, so... Oh... Okay, that was kind of creepy to know. When did you get that? You're back. There's the hangar. The base seems abandoned. Looks like we got here before the Oracle and the Purple Clan. They're not far away. I sense their presence. Jade's lost consciousness. She's at the end of her rope. We don't have much time. Are you sure that you don't want me to come with you? I don't know what's going to happen, Carla. I don't want to risk your life for no reason. Be careful. I need you. 
Aww. If I'm not back in 15 minutes, go back where we came from. Bogart will protect you. Oh. Just have a snowstorm. I am looking forward to winter, but if the entire world was covered in snow like this, we would die out. I ain't gonna lie, that's a scary thing. People freezing to death is probably the most easiest way to die, some say. It just feel nothing after you freeze so much, like numb. And I'm getting so tired of clicking those two buttons, but oh, I'm pretty close. <laughs> Come on, I don't want to click. Oh, I'm going. Oh, fuck. Yes, I'm so tired. <sighs> well, what would you know? We actually near the end. Anything else here? No? <laughs> Is that a crowbar on the ground or? Oh, I finally get to see what Lucas saw when he was a kid. What? Who are you? give you the child your tiny role is finished you can now disappear from the game we thank you for all that you have done for us ain't gonna happen again oh wow okay I guess this is the final battle I don't know Green stuff. Oh, okay. I guess that's a bad thing. Uh, oh, I'm charging up for something. Uh, it's too much. Ooh. Are you uh, trying to evolve to come and come here have when saw or something? I don't know. If this is a battle. Then I must say it's pretty easy. Okay, let's recharge some more. It's like they're trying to open the portal from the other side somehow. Okay. Almost to the top! That it? Huh, just smiling like, yeah, that was easy. What? Did you choke them? I just knocked them out. What? You? Than I thought, human. 
But the game is over. You and your race have lost. Your inferior species will disappear like the dinosaurs before you. We, the artificial intelligences, will be the new dominant race on this planet. Thanks to the secret of the child, we will know all. We will be more powerful than gods. Oh, what's happening? No, I'm not gonna just go. I won't let go. I got this far. Come on, my hands are getting tired. Take this! What's happening? Whoa! Was that it? Okay, before I even do anything, I want to make sure that there's something around here, like collectible or something, not. No? Not even a card? Huh, I guess not. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna pick you up and then we see what happens. This boat. She did. Come on. cold went away just like it had come oh. in silence as if the indigo child had turned the hourglass by delivering her message everything was just as it was before I guess that means the lesser evil the Oracle and the Orange clan went back to their places of power in the secret government of the world and the purple clan went back to haunting us on the net I should be happy I guess I've been living with Carla for three months She's the best thing that's happened to me in a long time. Nah. Yesterday, she told me that she's pregnant. <gasps> Must have been that night in Bogart's underground base. Oh. That means that our child was radiated by the chrome at Wishida, just like I was in my mother's womb. Oh. I don't know what's going to happen now. I'm the one and only keeper of the greatest secret in the universe. What should I do with all that power? Forget it? Put it in the service of humanity? I've never dreamt about being a god. I just want to live my life like anybody else, with my wife and my child. I'm afraid that destiny might have another path in mind for me. What are you thinking about, Luke? Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. I like this game. Oh, copyright music. Oh, 
Okay, I'm gonna say I enjoy this game a lot. I'm gonna catch up in a little bit. Okay, so. Since uh, I played through this game, um, it felt like I was playing Beyond Two Souls, even though it's the same developer. And I must say, I really, really enjoyed the game. Even though the near end fight was kind of easier, I don't know why, if it was because you had more uh, happiness, you know, by feeling physically better and better. I don't know, because the end of the, the previous fight, which happened in the roof, that was way harder. But the last boss in this game was so easy, I don't know why. And I think I would got a different ending if I allow myself to die right there. So, it would be way different, but I'm gonna say... Oh. Ooh! One of the world, what does that mean? I'm gonna check. Hold on a moment. Okay, so uh, I have checked through the trophy list and it's not the card, we are missing something. I'm gonna just say that this game is quite good, I enjoyed it a lot. I have to check online what the ending actually meant and it makes more sense for those who don't understand it. So if you play the game yourself, and you're wondering what it whole and they actually mean. Then you might as well just comment about it down below because I don't know how I'm gonna explain it. Because I know what it is, but how I'm not going to explain it. And I enjoyed this game so much. And I hope you did too. But I am going to focus on a different Really game now. I started with Resident Evil, but I still should go back to Beyond Two Souls. Because that game I still haven't got to start and finish with. Which I should. So I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye.